Since its creation, the LVTS has continued to contribute to the growth and stability of the Canadian and international financial sectors. It also plays an important role in three of Canada's other systemically important clearing and settlement systems. The Continuous Linked Settlement System, or CLS, the Canadian Derivatives Clearing Service, CDCS, and the CDSX. CLS is a global settlement system for foreign exchange transactions. It connects financial centers around the world which serve as anchors for the trading of 17 different currencies between certain FIs. In a typical foreign exchange transaction, a buyer purchasing one type of currency pays for the purchase using another type of currency. CLS was created to reduce settlement risk in foreign exchange transactions, which is the risk that a buyer could pay the seller the currency it is trading without receiving the currency it purchased because of the different time zones in which the currency must settle. CLS reduces this risk through direct links to settlement systems in the currencies it settles. When CLS began operations in 2002, LVTS assumed the role of the link that enables Canadian FIs to participate. The CDSX is Canada's clearing and settlement system for debt and equity securities, such as bonds and common stocks. It was implemented in 2003 to risk-proof securities trades, which are typically very high in value transactions. In CDSX, securities are not physically exchanged between the buyer and the seller. The transfer of ownership is recorded electronically and the securities are frozen in the system, which allows for efficient and cost-effective processing. A secure funds exchange takes place at the end of the day via LVTS and the CDSX account at the Bank of Canada. The Bank of Canada acts as a settlement agent for CDSX, since a private sector FI acting in that role would be too risky. A private sector FI going into default would leave everyone engaged in CDSX in a precarious position. Having the Bank of Canada act as settlement agent mitigates this banker risk since the Bank of Canada won't initiate any LVTS payments for CDSX settlement unless there are sufficient funds in that account to begin with. The Canadian Derivatives Clearing Corporation is a central clearing counterparty in Canada for exchange-traded derivative products such as options and futures and also settles using LVTS.